So I found this. It's really quiet in here. Creep TV and today we're in South Milwaukee at a graveyard I just pretty much googled and just kind of looked at it on a map I've never been here before I always knew that this place was here it's really not that big of a cemetery really doesn't have a creep factor to it I just wanted to come check it out uh, as you can see behind me it's pretty open in this section there's another section over there that's kind of I don't know if you call it like woodsy but it's behind a gate I already kind of went over there before and there's really I mean there's not much to look at a couple dead trees, a bunch of tombstones. Um, so yeah, I might actually scratch this. I'm not going to really do too much of a video here because there's just really not too much and it just is smaller than what I thought it was. But uh, we'll just take a peek. We'll, we'll just take a peek over the fence. So. And there's like a, a main road that runs like right over there. It's a lot of traffic and hear people weed whacking <laughs> but uh but yeah anyways guys uh go check out my instagram channel uh i'll put that in the video right now and make sure that you follow me on instagram i'm pretty active on that if you ever want to ask me questions and follow me there um but yeah we're just going to go to another spot today's just more of uh exploring whatever i can find during the day because i really don't want to do the night thing right now because uh where i live the geographic location is just, there's a lot of strict laws when it comes to coming into these places and I don't wanna get arrested or get trespassed. So I'm doing my due diligence and my research to see where I can go and getting permissions and whatnot. So I'll uh, see you at the next spot. So I found this, it's really quiet in here. I'm just gonna sit and see if I can hear anything in here. I mean, it's really quiet. I just heard something. Hello? I've never been in one of these before. I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little creeped out being in here knowing that what these are. me. Hello?
See, this place inside the mausoleum closes at five, but the rest of the cemetery, from what I looked on Google, it's 24 hours. So we'll go out there and explore for a little bit and uh, just see what it looks like during the daytime because I'll probably come back and do uh, explore it at nighttime later on tonight. But damn, man, I got anxiety in here, man. This is literally the first time I ever came to one of these places by myself. Oh, that was a lady that passed through. <laughs> there was a lady that passed right past that window over there. It freaked me out. I mean, when it comes down to it, guys, like, when you come into these places, you have to... You, you gotta hold a standard of respect, you know? It's, these are people's family members and loved ones, but I really think these, this place is really cool. I don't know if I'd wanna be put in a drawer when I pass away, but hey, it's whatever you want. And when I was watching one of Franco TV's uh, videos, he was in one of these places and he said the smell in here is it doesn't smell bad, but you can tell that they use like a potpourri and there's these uh, motors in here. I'll show you what those look like. I think it's to push the smell out. Hear that buzzing? So like that engages every so often and it sprays a mist, but there's these big ventilation systems in here that uh, filter the air out. There's hundreds of people in here. So I don't know if it's because I'm nervous a little bit because this is my first time coming into one of these things, but I have like anxiety coming in here. Like, I don't know if I'm not worried about anything. It's just. I feel like I'm not supposed to be in here. I mean, I don't have any family in here or anything like that. It's a car. All right, I'm not even kidding. I just went back to my car to grab my DSLR to do some B-roll in here. I swear to God, I saw somebody walk by this door over here. Like right, right here, I was looking at that. I was taking a photo of that. In the corner of my eye, I saw something walk right there. Hello? I'm not gonna lie, dude, I seriously got the goosebumps in here right now. I'm all alone in here, there's nobody else in here. <sighs> now, I, now I get what this is about. You get that boost of adrenaline doing stuff like this, but I'm not gonna lie, it's really creepy. All right, I'm gonna head outside. I had to make sure my phone was tilted right. Um, so we're gonna head outside. I kind of walked around this whole place for about six, seven minutes now, and we're gonna go see uh, what outside looks like. See if I'll come back later. All right, guys, I made it back outside. Now I'm in the main cemetery, I guess you would call it. Um, I'm walking on this really cool mausoleum that I just kind of saw when I came out those doors from the indoor mausoleums. Uh, it looks like one person has this, but check this out. It 
yeah so i'm just going to check that out real quick this place is pretty big so i don't know uh i might come back here at nighttime because it's 24 hours so we'll be able to explore this at nighttime guarantee you the police would probably see what we were doing but whatever it is what it is if we're just shooting video not destroying anything dude check this out got its own path It's locked. Can't really see in there. Too much glare. Well, yeah. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, this is pretty sweet for being uh, passed over, deceased. I don't know a respectful way to say it. Anyways, uh, yeah, that place is pretty cool, man. Um, I've never seen that before. Like, look at the floor, path. It's like all granite. Must be a rich dude. But, uh, yeah, guys. So, basically, uh, I'm going to end this section here. And I'll probably come back at night, which will probably finish up the video. If it doesn't, or if I don't, make sure you subscribe. Hit the like button. Let me know what you guys are interested in. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. I'll put that back up there now. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.